There are really so many different ways that you can tie search engine marketing to social media on both the paid search and the organic search side. Now on the paid side, it's really best to look at those marketing efforts that you are involved in anyway across your the different channels in your company. For example, let's say you're uploading a video to your company's website, or maybe you're putting it on YouTube or on Blinks or another video search engine. Um, you can actually use paid search to have ads that direct those users, those searchers, to these places where the video is housed via your destination page links, those landing pages. So it's an easy way to actually get direct traffic to where you want to have those customers go. Now on the organic side, there are a number of different things you can do as well. You can launch a strategic dig delicious you know, social bookmarking, social news type campaign. You can engage with bloggers online and encourage them to write about you and uh, which creates content about you and more links which in the end can help raise your organic ranking. Or you can get in there yourself and really get involved in, or in online communities uh, posting content and links and messages and, and really have some direct communication with your customers in the process. Really the sky's the limit. Just get creative. Because right now there is such an evolving marketplace in social media. There's really no right or wrong answers. And opportunities are abundant. Well, you know, if 2007 was about Facebook and MySpace, in my opinion, 2008 is about video. And we've really seen video explode over the past six months, um, especially with the popularity of YouTube and user-generated content. People love to make videos. And because of this, and because of the growth of universal search on Google, which is spread into ask.com and MSN, we are really, really seeing an emergence of a very strong vehicle here that um, has great ties to search engine marketing, as all of these videos can be optimized. And it's certainly something that marketers should keep on their radar for this year. Well, social bookmarking is the process of taking those favorite places that you have on the web, those sites, and putting them into one specific place so you can manage them, you can point others to them. Um, examples of a social bookmarking site are places like Delicious, where you can create an account and actually be able to point others, whether you're, they're your friends and colleagues, or maybe people that you don't even know, but who have similar interests to you. Um, but from a search engine marketing perspective, the real key here and why it's so important is that search engines more and more are picking up on these types of sites and seeing the relevance in them and pulling this information in and indexing it in the engines, which in the end will absolutely help your organic ranking. You know, I think a lot of times when people hear the word social media or social networks, they really don't get past the Facebooks and the MySpaces and the Digs. But really, there's a whole other world out there that can really allow you to connect one-to-one -one with your customer, and that's online communities. And by that, I mean um, forums and message boards, even tapping into certain blogs that are very relevant to your industry and your products and your services. It's a great way to get involved in social media and communicate one-on-one -on -one with your customers.